the blue Pacific waters of the Hawaiian Islands, a little piece of paradise that is a vacation escape for travelers from all over the world. But these young women aren't here for the scenery. They've come to work on a dream, representing their country at the Olympics. From Australia, Alana Slater and Lisa Skinner have already tasted Olympic competition. With experience and maturity, they hope to carry a young team looking to once again contend for an Olympic medal. The Chinese team has arrived with something to prove. They finished a disappointing fourth at the World Championships last summer. With Athens three months away, it's time to make a move. The USA women are reigning world champs and Olympic favorites. They're led by Carly Patterson, whose floor routine nailed down that world title last August. Now, Carly and a few unfamiliar faces have come to Hawaii to try and impress their coaches and the judges. They want to show the world they can do it. Four women looking to make a statement they hope will last all the way to Greece. Today, the final international gymnastics test before the Games of Athens. A chance to see how the competition looks as the clock ticks down. This is the Pacific Alliance Championships. Nine nations have brought their teams to the gorgeous shores of Waikiki Beach and Hawaii on the island of Oahu. And in the Stan Sheriff Center, a chance to see how the United States feels about defending its world championship at the Olympic Games. Carly Patterson to the left here in Honolulu. They come together, four athletes per team, three scores count, and the Australians will be part of this first rotation. They've got their game faces on. They had some things to cheer about at the Sydney Olympic Games, but now they'll take their two stars and try to build on that. The Chinese team will not be part of this first rotation, but we will see them for sure. Al Trowick along with Olympic gold medalist Tim Daggett and Elfie Schlegel, and guys, as we get set to see the faces that could become part of the big story in Athens, Greece. 